he gave me some money for mum. I just don't give what, what did you give it to her? Well no, not all of it. You know what? She's like, man, she asked too many questions. I know man. So what'd you tell her? I told her I've been helping out down the market after school and on a Saturday. <laughs> but man, I'll give her the rest next week, plus I'm really grateful. Yeah, I bet she was, man. Okay. Alright, so what do you do for this money, man? For nothing. Whatever, man, really. Do you know what? He said I could earn some more as well, you yeah, know. Doing what, man? I'm just running a few errands. Nah, 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 nah. Forget that, man. Forget that. Man, I'm fucked you, you know. He gave me a phone. Did he what? Gave me a phone so he could contact me. He probably robbed the phone, man. So what, man? It was a nice phone. Man, look, saying so he ain't getting phones. Didn't oh, end up here. man. You ain't my dad, you know. Yeah, but he just... It's a very important message, it is. Um, this type of thing happens on a daily basis, as we all know, every time you turn on the news, stuff like this is happening um, in everywhere in London. So it is something that needs to be addressed. Um, and I think more events like this would bring in an audience that wouldn't normally pay attention to what's going on. So, yeah. If it wasn't for you, my cousin would still be alive. Let me tell you something about your cousin, yeah? He was one of my boys. He was loyal and he made his own decisions. Something that you wouldn't understand, you hear me? Yeah? When he was one of your boys, why didn't you look out for him, huh? Why didn't you stop him from getting killed, right, huh? Right, it's clear. Well, allow it, man, allow it. Well, well, allow it, man. 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 Allow it,